Update. The full board approved the 2021-22 tuition rates Friday morning. The three campuses of the University of Alabama system want to keep tuition rates unchanged for most students this fall. The system's board of trustees will vote on the proposed 2021-22 rates Friday. The board's finance committee approved the recommendations on Thursday. System Chancellor Finnis St. John praised the recommendation to keep rates flat for most students. This is very responsible and accountable administration by our campuses, St. John said Thursday. Last summer, the tuition froze tuition for in-state and out-of-state undergraduate and graduate students. In April, Auburn University voted to freeze its next year of tuition rates for the first time in 30 years. The only tuition increases proposed are for distance learning students at UA and a handful of rates at the University of Alabama in Huntsville for course loads of less than 12 hours, according to a presentation by UA System's Senior Vice Chancellor for Finance and Administration, Dana Keith. The University of Alabama at Birmingham proposed no changes to its rates. The University of Alabama proposed 2.63% to 5% increases for its distance learning rates, while leaving rates for on-campus instruction unchanged from the current year. The tuition rate for distance learning at UA would increase to $385 per credit hour for undergraduates and to $440 for graduate students. The rates for distance learning are the same for residents and non-residents with the exception of students at UA's Gadsden Center, where it operates an academic outreach program. The rates are higher for non-residents because courses have a physical location, according to the board presentation. Non-resident undergraduates at the Gadsden Center would pay $1,052 per credit hour, and graduate students would pay $1,243 per credit hour. The rate for distance learning in the law school would increase $87 to $1,822 per credit hour. UA is also proposing increasing the distance learning tuition in its Nursing Science Ph.D. graduate program to $417 to align with rates at UAH, which jointly offers the program. The university estimates the increase will generate $1.4 million for distance learning programs at UA, according to the presentation to the trustees. UAH is seeking increases of $1 to $3 to rates for some course loads below 12 hours to make the tuition by the credit hour equally divisible without any cents. The campus is also planning to increase to its dining and infrastructure fees. Huntsville's campus dining fee would increase $10 to $355 as a result of a contractual requirement, Keith said. The infrastructure fee would increase $5 per credit hour, or approximately $60 per semester, and will be used to improve the campus's technology and facilities. The board also chose last year to leave rates unchanged for in-state and out-of-state students as it faced the uncertainty of the pandemic.